Good evening YouTube, Yellow Belly here. Just a quick uh, update on the van conversion. Um, I've not been well recently so I've not been able to get a lot of work done on it. Uh, and also the weather has been horrific, absolutely horrific. Uh, what have I done so far? Um, we've got curtains put up, uh, as you can see behind me here, in the van. Uh, all round actually. Uh, the wife wants nets. <laughs> So I've got that to source out, uh, but yeah, got some nice curtains and I've put a vinyl floor in. Uh, I bought the vinyl floor tiles from B and Q. Uh, a bit expensive, but there you go. I've put a table in for the kids, uh, and uh, I think that's about it. Really, not much else. Next stop is actually going to be working on the electrics, uh, but I'll, I'll give you a quick squeeze of where we're up to so far. Now then, just bear with me while I turn this camera round, or try to turn this camera around. For some reason, it's not it's not doing it. What's this? Hmm. Okay, not working. Oh God, look at the state of that. Right. Well, as you can see, uh, this is the bedroom unit. I'll do it this way, and we have curtains that go straight across the bedroom. Uh, we've got a roll blind up there, and then. A little blind over the kitchen unit there then we have again nice curtains attached all the way across then in, we've got a curtain that divides the cab now from there we go it, it divides the cab from the rest of the the van and there's also one that goes across the the side door it's a bit dark sorry about that uh, but yeah that goes across the bus opening door opening ah, there you go so again that's about it really not been up so much uh, oh yeah nice uh, I don't know if you can see that vinyl flooring there we go and yeah so uh, I'm getting electrics from, if I can open that cabinet, no, you can't see in that, it's too dark. There is, uh, on the kitchen side, I've got to fit in a, oh, let's put that camera down. I've got to fit a 12 volts uh, for the fridge. I've got a Outwell camping fridge for the, what else have we got? The, the pump for the water, the water pump and all the lighting around the kitchen and to go back into the bedroom unit and on the, this side I need uh, the side where the fire is I need one for the shower which is still not complete that's a 12 volt pump that goes to there and then uh, he says dropping his phone stupid cheap pound line st stand <sighs> Then where the mirror is there, I need a 240 volt socket. So uh, I'll be getting an inverter, etc. And where the mirror is, uh, I'll probably just put it on this wall here so the wife can connect a hairdryer up and stuff like that for women's necessities. And then again, more lighting. So ooh, let's just have a seat. Ooh. Yeah, mainly furnishing that's been going on. Uh, with the and the wife's been doing that. She's uh, she knows what she wants. Uh, we're going for a, a nature theme and uh, well, green, green everywhere. I raised the table uh, just by about two inches. We found after we put padding on the seat here, it was too um, what's the word? Too low. So the uh, I've raised that a couple of inches and bolted it to the floor. Uh, I'm really happy with the progress, apart from being ill and not being able to do much. And the weather has been stinking. It's been horrible up here in Wales. Uh, high winds, the whole van shakes in the winds. And uh, there's a couple of bits that need still need doing. But I'm going to focus mainly next on electrics. Uh, big shout out to 25 Klansman. He, uh, he he requested a, an update. He just well, he asked how, when I was going to do the next one, so I thought I'd do a quickie. <clears throat> and uh, also, just just give um, some people an idea 
uh, we had a long chat about depression on Xyphos stream and on uh, well, I was chatting to Clansman about it. Uh, I, I, I was diagnosed with uh, depression years ago. Uh, oh, good, eight years ago. And at first it was like, oh, mental health issues, uh, stigma. But when the doctor explained to me that it's a chemical imbalance, it's chem basic chemistry, then that was easy for me to get to grips with. Um, because I think, yeah, well, it's, you know, it's not my fault. It's, it's, it's something, it's chemistry, basically. So it's an illness. And uh, I was explaining to the clansman, uh, well, to... to to carry on about my health and that I've also got um, Graves disease which is basically my thyroid's knackered and it causes micro shakes uh, I shake a lot from it uh, I'm constantly tired uh, I mean it is being managed at the hospital I'm, I'm in and out of hospital but also unfortunately the downside is I'm going blind from it so when you see uh, when we my videos start getting more blurry, you'll understand why, but I am going blind from it. Uh, I've already lost a lot of sight out of my right eye. Uh, your left as viewing this. It's uh, it's just something I've, you have to come to terms with. There's nothing I can do about it. Um, I'm just going to make the most of what, what time I've got seeing as such. Um, that's why this is happening and uh, I'm making video logs etc just for, for me more than anybody but yeah it's um, it does affect me depression obviously especially when I'm having really bad days uh, with my eyesight I can't see as much as I used to it's uh, I'm on stupidly str strong uh, glasses to do when I'm painting and stuff I've, I've always been a creative sort of person I love painting little miniatures uh, games workshop stuff and uh, yeah it's, it's, it does get to you for a while uh, but as I was saying to Klansman the reason the whole idea of me doing these videos of things I've made things I'm doing is a record really for myself it's a good way to actually make yourself more positive because when you're depressed, it's oh, if you dwell on it, it re the the bad stuff. You you just go that far down. It's ridiculous, and there's, it just seems like a, a bottomless well. But with uh, me doing these videos, I, I get to watch them and focus on the good things in life, I, I, things I've made, things I've things that I've achieved. Things I like. I mean, I love me Amstrad at the moment. You know, I always have loved Amstrad CPCs. It was my main computer throughout my teenage years. So I love doing gaming on that, and joining in with Zypho and Mo and my Novabug, who's absolute sound YouTube streamer. Love him to bits. Real guy. So yeah, and just spending time with people that enjoy the same things I do. So. It's a good antidepressant, if you wish, if you look back on your own videos. And this is why it's, I don't care about views. I don't care about um, subs and stuff like that because I do this for me. If people like my videos, great. If they don't, okay. It's, you know, horses for courses and stuff like that. So, yeah, if, you, if you're feeling, you know, depress, depressed or you're under medication like I am for depression... Maybe just make yourself a YouTube channel. If you've already got one, maybe a separate one just for yourself. Just so you can record the good things in your life. And, and, and it does help. It really does help you a lot. Right, so that's it for now. Uh, hopefully next video is going to be a DDI3 when it turns up. For me, I'm Strad. I'll uh, do a quick vid on that one. And uh, that's it for now. So love to you all and uh, get a belly out.